I'm attorney Nick Alcock. We're going to talk a little bit about immigration and give you an update as to what's happening with immigration, the policies and procedures, and effectively what we know about uh, the changes that have been announced by the Obama administration. From what we can tell, it appears that there hasn't been very much change at all in the way that people are being deported or the way that the government is seeking removal. Uh, what is apparent is that there is a process where an application essentially will be submitted to the government and they will review every single uh, pending case, pending deportation or removal case. They're going to look uh, at the, the specifics of what's going on with that individual. From what we've been told, uh, sort of off the record, is that very few of these applications will actually be granted. And it's a going to be a tremendous amount of work, obviously, for us to do an application for every single client. And believe me, we're going to do it for every client. But unfortunately, we've been kind of given the heads up that uh, not a very high percentage of these applications will be granted. And it sounds like it's going to be business as usual. Now, there may be something going on that we don't uh, know of right now. Obviously, this hasn't really happened yet, and it hasn't. We haven't been in a position where all of these applications are being actively denied. It just seems like it's uh, very likely that it's going to be business as usual in Florence, Eloy, and, and downtown Phoenix and immigration courts. So if you are facing deportation, if you're facing removal, if you're looking to get a bond, uh, our advice to you is to obviously proceed and, and file the application and, and do what you can to avoid deportation at this point. But it's probably a good idea not just to rely on this idea on the concept that if you don't have a criminal record and you've been living here for a long time that you don't have to worry about anything if you are facing deportation that basically the, the prosecution, the government is going to, to give up the case and they're only going to be, what, what's been said is that they're only going to be really concentrating on people that have criminal backgrounds and uh, you know we just don't know what that means at this point and unfortunately the news sounds like it's not going to be uh, a blanket amnesty like like the detractors have been saying that this is just going to give people uh, a right to work it's it sounds like it's very focused on a case-by-case -case basis some people will be allowed to stay we're going to keep you advised as to what's going on if i hear anything we'll put it up on our uh, blog and we'll have it obviously on youtube as well alcock law az is our youtube channel you can obviously give us a call as well 602-989-5000 is our number 602-989-5000 my name is nick alcock i'm the owner of alcock and associates if you have an immigration case, like to have a question answered, free consultation, no pressure whatsoever. We're happy to answer any questions that you have. Thanks so much.